Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so that's time for a grocery pool. Today is Monday the 20th, no, sorry, the 17th. <laughs> Today's the 17th of December. Just got done at the grocery store, like I usually do on Mondays. Um, this time I'm wearing another Christmas sweater. This is, I've had all these sweaters forever. I accumulate after a few years. Uh, this has the Naughty List. It has Marilyn Monroe on it. It has some like glitter stuff all over it. And I kind of like it. I don't know where I got this. A lot of times people ask me where I get these sweaters. Like either it could be Target, it could be Walmart. Um, it could even be the grocery store. Some things I get at the grocery store. But it just has snowflakes and just normal my my normal stuff. My Jagans and my this is like a tank shirt underneath. And this is actually like an ear warmer, like bandana. That you wear like this, but sometimes I wear my scarves to make it kind of look like because uh, sometimes it's a swoop neck, it's just kind of it needs something, you know. Plus, sometimes if you're cold and it kind of goes with the white trim, white trim. So sometimes I'll use a lot of like the headbands as a scarf. So, anyway, anyway, the, the final total which says okay, spoiler well, I'll tell you the final total, of course, you know, in the in the in the description $89.54 I always try to go under a hundred dollars which is usually okay but sometimes I go over like there's might be something I need something whatever Christmas or whatever but um it would have been $79 but um Ralph's has this thing uh, where it's like you get a cardboard box and there's two of them there's a five dollar one and a ten dollar one and you take it to the register and they ring you up and it's basically an empty cardboard box. So I don't have it. They take it back and they put it back on the shelf. Um, it symbolizes um, like a, a box of food. Uh, $10, I did a $10 donation. It's basically food for the needy, people that need food that are hungry during the holidays. Uh, Kroger, I think, is doing it. A uh, Ralph's here in California, Ralph's. And um, yeah, they have a five dollar box or a ten dollar box. I got the ten dollar box, and so I donated ten dollars to people that are hungry during the holidays. It basically feeds them a whole holiday meal. I don't know. You could Google it. I don't know too much. I don't want to say too much because I don't know. It's just basically I donated food. So, so even though I spent eighty nine dollars and fifty four cents, ten dollars of it went to donations. So I got seventy nine dollars worth of stuff so just letting you know so if you're like oh my god you got hardly anything for that price I mean, so just let you know that's where ten dollars of money went okay first things first well not first things whatever i got him i got some wine bags because i didn't really do too much grocery shopping this year because um, money's kind of tight right now this month has been really like unexpected uh expenses so I really had to tighten the belt and I, you know, I'm just like, I'm a little stressed. <laughs> I'm a lot stressed actually. Um, but I'm still trying to have fun, you know, cause it's the holiday season. So, um, since I haven't been drinking much wine, um, I do have a lot of wine. Plus I kind of want to buy some better wine, but, uh, as gifts, because I just don't want the waste wine to go to waste. I mean, I'm sure I'll drink it eventually, but it's like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I might for emergency gifts, you know, I mean like things happen, you get invited someplace and stuff. So I, I thought I would buy some wine gift bags. So if I'm going somewhere, it looks more festive for the holidays. And these are $1.99 each. It's a little pricey for me, but it's the holidays. It says eat, drink, and be merry. That's one of them. And this one just says cheers. I like it with the, with the plaid. It just says cheers. So that's that one. And then I got this other one that says Cheers. It looks like that TV show. They're $1.99 each. It's a little pricey, but like I said, I, you know, sometimes when things happen, you don't want to go all the way to the store and go over the rush and the flow. It's nice to be prepared. And I probably will eventually go try to find some good wine. I just didn't want to take the time because the grocery store today was chaotic. Like, there's so many people there. It was like chaotic. It was like Black Friday type of day. So um, when I have more time, or I might visit one of the mom and pop uh, stores and spend my money there and find like a nice good bottle of wine, like browse and take my time. 
So, but if needed, I do have wine backup. You know, so if I need a gift on the fly, I got it. But at the same time, I kind of want to get a better wine to give. You want to be part of the vlog, Mr. Felix? You want to make me room for you? Okay, I'll, I'll make Go up there if you want to. <coughs> if you want to, go ahead. <coughs> Sorry, I got this cough. <coughs> I've been sleeping a lot. Long story. I think I told you about this little depression thing I'm going through. Don't worry. I'll be okay. But also, it gets dark early, and I just lose my energy. I've been sleeping too much, and I I kind of got this um, thing in the... feels like in the lungs. Like, it almost feels like... I don't want to say pneumonia, but you know when you're in the hospital for too long and you're sleeping too long, they always get you up and they force to breathe you because um, sometimes you get this little lump of phlegm or, or stuff in your lungs. <coughs> I feel like it's there, and I just can't get it. Like I, I try to cough as deep as I can. But if something's <coughs> there that's bothering me. It's really deep inside. But anyway, well, go ahead if you want to say hi to the people. You don't want to be picked up. So if you want to go up there, you can. Okay. My Lysol was on sale for $5.99. Usually it's eight, like $8.99, like almost $9. It was on sale for $5.99, so of course I had to get some, like the real Lysol, because sometimes I get the cheapy kind. But, um... Yeah, what, you, now, you don't, what? Walking away. <coughs> but, five ninety nine. so I'm very excited about that. And I got some more brandy, because, you know, I do put it in the eggnog. Um, and also, I haven't opened up my apple cider yet. I haven't been feeling like it. But I think I'm going to do it soon. Um, I like to warm up the hot apple cider. I have, I have a lot of it. And then I like to spike it with a little bit of this. So I think this will be the end of it because I, um, I have a full bottle. So I just got a backup. Um, but I think this is it because it's on sale this time. It's like $8.99, like 9 bucks. So I got that. Oh, I got these are my candles. Yeah, I thought that was sweet of them. Some of them don't do this. These are only a dollar each. And I don't, oh, this is the apple. I got apple cinnamon crisp. They didn't have that many good flavors or for scents, I mean. But, um, yeah, apple cinnamon crisp. I figured they'd go with anything. And then if it gets past the holidays, those are those are kind of fragrances that goes with, it goes out all the time. So that bag is done. And then I've been eating a lot of bread lately. In fact, it's gone. And so I got some more of it. I got this as um, the 60 calories. This is a thinner slice. This was like $3.99, $4.99. And it's like whole grains and seeds, organic bread. It's killer days. I love this bread. I've been eating just nothing but vegetables. What I do is I toast this up. I put some butter on it. Or I put some um, either butter and or Miracle Whip. And then I cut up a bunch of cucumbers. I cut up some zucchini. I'll cut up some tomatoes. And then I uh, toast it with some cheese on top of it. And then I make like a, kind of like a grilled sandwich, but it's just all veggies. I wish I had sprouts. I love sprouts, but they don't sell them back. Oh my God. They do kind of, I should have got some. They have not really like the old alfalfa sprouts, but they have a certain kind of sprout that's very, oh, darn it. I should have got some. Because those, that's so good. That's what I've been eating. Like, that's what I've been craving. That's all I've been eating. So I got some more bread because I ran out. Darn it, I should have got sprouts. Forgot. Oh, well. Okay, the cat food, the last one I got, I don't think Felix likes it because usually he eats like crazy. You know, like... Hold on. What was that? That was crazy. My phone went really crazy. Um, usually, like, when I'm getting ready in the morning, he'll run. Like, his like his life depends on it to his food bowl and eats it. And it's like, he has been doing that. I don't think he likes the food. He's been sniffing around at his uh, big food container because I have the, the Tupperware food container. Like, he's hungry. And I'm like, what's going on? I don't think he likes the food. Remember, like, they, they don't have his food that I usually get. And so I'm baffled. Like, I don't know what to get. Like, I like the urinary tract food. 
the um, like the stuff that helps the pH balance. They don't have any of it. So I'm hoping you'll like this. And I've been buying small bags because I'm not going to buy a big bag if he doesn't like it. So I'm going to try this one now. This is Indoor Delights. I don't know. He has cat grass. So he's, he's fine with that. He's playing with that. But this is just friskies. It's not urinary tract health. But it has chicken, beef, salmon, cheese, and garden greens. <coughs> I'm hoping, you know, he's used to frisky. So I used to get friskies um, urinary tract health. But the same brand. So I'm hoping he'll like this one. You think you like this one better? Felix, because he doesn't like that one, that abound, the one I got last week. Look at the one I got last week. It had, it had the herring and all that. Yeah, I don't think he likes it. So, good thing I bought the small kind. Lately, I've been buying these little frozen meals. I haven't eaten them. So, I think this is going to be it until I start eating some because I don't want to get, like, I don't want to start stocking up. But, I've been eating a lot of just cold salads lately, so I'm like, you know what? It'd be nice to have like a, a hearty meal, but like a vegetarian meal. And I don't I don't have the money to go out right now. Plus, I hate like I, I did take myself out to the Queen Mary and I tried to eat something, but I got full, like they bring out this big thing because it's, like, it's meant to be with a group of people. And I ate a little bit and I got full and I just sent it back. I didn't want to bring it home because it was just too much. It was too rich. It was like this cheese dip. When I go out, it's kind of a waste of money because unless I unless I come home, if I ever go out, I I don't I can't have any plans afterwards because when I go out to eat, I would have to know I because I'm gonna bring a doggy bag because I don't want to waste that food. Oh my God, I think he is hungry. Okay, hold on, I'll do this afterwards. He's biting into it. Obviously, you don't like that food, so it's a waste of money because I won't eat it all. And I don't want to send it back because later on during the night, I might want it, you know. So I would have to get a doggy bag and take it home. So I could never go out to eat and then go somewhere else. Unless I'm with a group of people and we all share and we pick. Now that I could do. But long story short, this is why I'm just starting. I'm just going to eat my meals at home uh, more likely. But yet I'm craving more different stuff. This is like Amy's Bowls. This is like a, a vegan type of thing. This is uh, called Harvest Casserole. It has organic quinoa, kale, and roasted sweet potatoes. Just look kind of good. You know, I don't know. It was like $3.99 or something. I'm going to get you. He wants to be chased. He's Whenever they look at you and your cats look at you with those saucer eyes like that, they, they want to play. And I just stamp my foot and he runs. He just likes to be chased. So cute. And, of course, since I've been eating a lot of salads, I had to get more of this. Seriously, I've been eating nothing but greens. That's all I've been craving. For some reason, I've only been craving, like, like vegetables. Speaking of vegetables, I got, like, a zucchini and I got a cucumber. And you're probably wondering, wait a minute, last week you didn't get that. Well, I kind of cheated on you. <laughs> there was one day, I forget what day it was, I was craving a cucumber sandwich. Sometimes I just get a cucumber sandwich. I get bread and I get some... Um, uh, Miracle Whip, and I slice up some cucumbers, and I just have a cucumber sandwich. I just love cucumbers, so I did kind of go to the store just for the, just for a cucumber and sorry, but just for a cucumber and um, a zucchini. So I grabbed two more because I love them so much. And then guess what? The cheese was on sale, even though I haven't really been eating cheese, but I had to get it right. Dollar eighty-eight. Dollar eighty-eight. Had to. So I got my normal Mexican blend. And then I got some sharp cheddar. Something different. So that's my sale because it was a dollar eighty-eight. I had to. And then of course we need more toilet paper. So or my roommate did, so I got some more toilet paper for him. So there he goes. Okay, and then I did get one more thing of fruit. I think I'm stocking up on this because I haven't really been drinking uh, like I said, champagne or wine that very, I mean, like today, last weekend I did. There's one me this weekend that just passed, but not that much. But I've been using the cranberry, and I like it so much better than the orange juice. I think that's my new thing. The orange juice is just too hard on my stomach. The cranberry is just a lot easier. It's more refreshing. Uh, sometimes I like grapefruit juice, too. So I just got my $5.99 champagne. And then they had a closeout special for this. I don't know why. $2.69 or something, which is... A okay of a sale, but
but I hope they're not getting rid of it. But this is the Oreo cookie uh, creamer, which I like. So I got some Oreo cookie creamer. And, and then I do I do use Miracle Whip a lot, and so I got some backup because I do have some in the refrigerator. But I always have to have backup. I like this because you don't need a knife. You just plop, plop, plop. You put it on that like mustard. I love my Miracle Whip. I love my Miracle Whip. And then I use this once in a while, but I've been using it lately. I don't know if you can tell. I don't even know what I've been using. I haven't been drinking wine. I should be doing this when I'm drinking wine, but maybe not because sometimes when it makes your teeth more porous, you get more stains. But uh, I think those are on sale for five something. I don't know, but it's Optic White. It works pretty good. It whitens your teeth pretty good. It says Colgate Optic White. So I got some toothpaste for that. And then, you know, I don't really like eat sweets that often, but like I'll grab them if I feel like a craving for it. I've been craving like a cookie every once in a while, and all I have is like candies, and I'm like, Ugh, sick of the candies. Um, so I figured that, and plus we'll go good with coffee in the morning. So I just grabbed some cookies. They're $4.99. They're just sugar cookies, and they're made at the store. They're, they're not like store-bought, but in a way they are, but they make them at the store. Okay. And then I got a red onion because I've been eating a lot of salads and, and, and vegetable sandwiches. Red onion goes really good with that. So I got that. And then I got some heirloom tomatoes because look at this big fat guy. He's huge. So I like, okay, I got to take you home. And then I got a yellow tomato. So I got two heirloom tomatoes for my salad and sandwiches. Mm -hmm. I think they're organic too. Alright, the last and but not least, I got more water. Which last time I said I didn't need it. Oh wait a minute, maybe it's not last. There's something in there. <laughs> uh, but um, I've been drinking a lot of water lately. Like literally, it's like I've been really good except for the sleeping too much depressed thing and you know, just kind of like on weekends, I basically just stay home and do nothing and be a bum, a bum, and just sleep. Um, but other than that, I've been eating really good and drinking a lot of water. So uh, I had to get more water. And there is one more thing. Oh, yeah, this stuff, this helps because the dentist told me, like, I get, um, I'm a mouth breather, so I sleep with my mouth open sometimes. I don't recall that, but I guess when I actually sleep, because I have, you know, I have breathing issues. And when you do that, if you're a mouth breather, you're prone to, like, uh, get bacteria in the gums, and that's not good. You, uh, it makes unhealthy gums. So I get this to help that. It's Gum Detoxify. is by Crest. Um, this wasn't really on sale. It was, like, $5.99 or something like that. Um which I guess is okay. I don't know. I guess it's an okay price, but for toothpaste, like, you know, but whatever. And it's gently whitening, but this is, I use this every day. The other whitening that uh, this stuff, I don't use every day, but sometimes I'll use every day for like a couple weeks and then I stop. Like I don't use it all the time because I do brush my teeth twice. I know the first time I brush it with a normal toothbrush, uh, with no normal toothbrush, with this or some other toothpaste and then I get the electric toothbrush to get in the back where I can't get to and so I get the electric toothbrush to get the back and that's when I use this so that way like I clean that sucker clean that sucker okay well that is a grocery haul this is kind of wet this is a long-winded one isn't it um, that's $89, but actually, technically, $79, because $10 went to donation. So, there you go. I'm going to let you go, because you know the spill. i got to put everything away, and then i got to clean the house and vacuum. Uh, I do have to do Josephine's case. I have to clean it probably this week. And then, of course, I have to edit and, and upload. You know the deal. You know the deal, right? All right, well, I'll let you guys go. To all my Stace Cadets, all my Briquettes, I hope you have a great day. Until next time, peace.